Item 5, County Attorney Report. <coughs> Thank you, Mr. Chairman. The first item that I have is. Uh, if if you want to talk, please go outside. First item I have is item 5A, as you alluded to earlier, Mr. Chairman, it pertains to a certain degree to the mining, in that the board had previously directed staff to publish a request for qualifications for an uh, engineering consulting firm to assist in determining whether or not the application submitted by HPS2 LLC complied with the Bradford County Land Development Regulations. In response to the request for product, I'm sorry, request for qualifications that we published on June 2nd, 2017, we received one response from a firm named OEC Tonight, Adam Hoyles and Janet Herrick are here representing OEC to answer any questions that the board might have. The issue on the agenda for tonight is whether or not the board desires to award the project to OEC and direct staff to engage with them to develop an agreement which would be brought back to the board for approval and which at that time would outline presumably uh, issues related to price and scope of work and time scope time scale for the project. I think the, the materials that OEC provided in response to the RFQ were provided in your packet. And as I said, um, two folks from their firm are here and can answer any questions that the board has. Thank you all for coming. Thank you for waiting. Thank you. Um, how can I help? <laughs> Um, I, just to clarify, um, our role will be to advise uh, staff and the County Commission on environmental issues related to this project. Um, we're not here to uh, promote or refute the mine, but rather to make sure you guys are prepared um, to understand the material, understand what your the decisions that are being made, understand the presentations that are coming before you, uh, and help you separate fact from fiction. Um, you know, without really digging into the meat and potatoes of the work, I, I can't really say a whole lot more about it, but if there's any questions, I'll be happy to answer them. Any questions? Okay. Uh, Mr. Hoyles. 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 Mr. Hoyles, so you understand, and I think you just mentioned that, that your role would be just to review the current information that we have for us to make a sound decision on whether we move forward or not. Correct. Is that correct? Okay. Yes. Okay. So we can still leave the option open to looking for, uh, once you're, if we go into contract, once your information is complete, we can still leave that open, uh, you know, to uh, asking for further assistance based on the information that you provide. Correct. Okay. Yeah, and, and you guys are really driving the scope on that. You know, it just depends on what your needs are and what you want, um, the level of review you require. So we'll base our advice on our knowledge of working for everybody from private homeowners to um, you know, the city of Jacksonville. We do a lot of work for Clay County Utility Authority. Um, and we'll just bring all of that to bear and help make sure you guys are informed. Yes, because as, as this board has said several times, we know nothing about Wall Street money. Period. There's a lot of questions. Yes. There's a lot of big issues and a lot of big decisions that you'll be making. And I want to just make sure you guys have got everything you need to be able to evaluate that. Right. Yes, sir. And that's, and that's where you could help us with an unbiased decision and facts. That's the goal. That's the goal. All right. All right. Is there any other questions, board? Thank you, Mr. Morrison. Thank you. Thank you. Um, but this 